Hey, what's up, everybody? It's the Untouchable Wolf, and if you're new to my channel, please make sure to subscribe for more Elden Ring how to videos and live streams. And thank you so much for support, it truly does mean a lot. Today, I'm gonna be talking about how to use the pole blade of the bud. So, let me show you right now where you can get this weapon. You want to go and fight Romina, um, and then once you do defeat her, you'll be able to turn her remembers in, and you can get the pole blade of the bud. So let's talk about the pole blade of the bud. The stats it does have the Romina's purification. It is a um, bleed uh, weapon or a scarlet rot build up. So attacks cause build up of rot. So you see it does scale in arcane. The stats that you need, the tributes are required, are strength at 14, dexterity at 22, arcane at 20. And do you see right here, we have the scaling and strength, dexterity, and arcane. You see the attack power of the physical is 131 plus the 100, critical at 100. And Romina's purification cost, the FP cost is 24. So this costs a little bit of FP. You need to keep that in mind. Now, when it comes to my level, you see I'm a level 507. I really enjoy Elden Ring. I've been playing it since the very beginning getting of release and the DLC is just amazing so I uh, make sure to check out my channel I have tons of videos as well as live streams I will be live streaming very very soon so you know of course talismans are very very important I have the green turtle talisman the blood um, talisman we have the shard of Alexander and then the blade of mercy and then I will be having you see my incantation if you like the scarlet in incantation um, to help you know it's all about your play style so and what you like to use so when it comes to the basic attacks pressing the r1 button now the heavy attack with the right trigger holding it just tap it charge it up you can hold it with both hands by pressing the triangle and the right bumper you want to block now what is very very um cool when it comes to the Romina's purification it does make you fly a little bit so we're gonna hold down the left trigger really really cool um a weapon art right there so let me know your thoughts about that in the comment section down below and of course we're going to go to my testing area to test this weapon out so if you want to see where i'm at on the map this is just a really good area i like to test my weapons and then go over here and test the weapon out with enemies all right so if you have any questions about this weapon let me know in the comment section down below i see how it is and keep in mind if you do enjoy this weapon make sure to get it fully upgraded I mean, I really like it already, like without it being fully upgraded. It's just really nice, you know, combine it with your spells, whatever. Really nice weapon. Like untouchable wolf. I got you stuck in my fence or gate. No, you don't, my friend. No, you don't. Let's do a little dance, a dance with the untouchable wolf. Oh, he got me right there. a good battle indeed it's like untouchable wolf you are no touch for me let's do another dance my friend let's do another dance
That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. Let's go. So if you found my video helpful or entertaining, please make sure to give me a like rating and subscribe for more Elden Ring how to videos and live streams. And thank you so much for support. It truly does mean a lot. If you have any questions about this weapon, just let me know as well. And once again, thanks for taking the time out of your day to watch my video. I truly do appreciate it. So thanks for watching and take care and more wolf videos be coming soon. Later. Peace. Ooh.